Yep, you knew it was coming. You knew it was coming. Let's just start this motherfucker. The Exorcist is a movie that has that old saying, this movie is so wrong, but it's so, so good type of feel. Yeah, that's this movie. This movie is fucked six ways from Sunday upside the head. <laughs> and it's all a good thing because, uh, damn, what an awesome movie. Okay? So, the simple plot of The Exorcist, of course, is we have Reagan, a 12-year-old girl, of course, who gets possessed by a demonic spirit, of course, via a Ouija board, basically. And now, her mom, after trying all these other things, doctors and what have you, and nothing else works, decides to call upon two priests, okay? Two exercise the demon out of her daughter. What a fucking awesome, awesome movie, okay? This has got to be one of the weirdest and almost still scariest movies I've ever seen, okay? I am 20 fucking 7 years old and this movie still fucking creeps me out just a little bit. Just a little bit. I'm not gonna bullshit you. This movie still creeps me the fuck out. Okay? Watching it when I was younger? Yeah. Uh, I had to turn the lights on when I was younger. I had to turn the lights on. I couldn't do it no more. <laughs> now, watching the movie on Blu ray, however, you do notice a few things differently than you do on TV. Like, you notice the strings and stuff. But that's a minor little thing. It was the 70s, of course, but the acting in this movie is just so, so good. I mean, Linda Blair outshines everybody in the entire film. How did she do it? I don't fucking know. That's just talent. That is just fucking talent right there. And yeah, the movie got made two years after the book was released, too. So they knew this movie was going to be fucking awesome. That, 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 that's dedication. I love that. I do. I actually love that. And the voices that comes out of this girl's mouth is fucking creepy as shit, man. And let me tell you something. If my fucking daughter came down the stairs spider walking like crazy, I, I would have to put her down at that point. I, I have to put her down. <laughs> because uh, that that's just fucking sick, man. Got the blood coming out of her mouth, coming down the stairs. Man. But it's so awesome. <laughs> it's just so, so awesome. Man, it... Ah, where to put this movie in the top horror movies of all time? It's... Ah, it's gotta be a slow top first two between this and Psycho. Th th that's gonna be a battle, and I can't wait to put that list together and that video together. It's gonna be a battle, but uh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna fucking do it. But, but uh, yeah. Amazing actors, amazing acting. Uh, I want to say some effects in here are good, but not like computerized effects. I'm talking about like all the practical stuff was good. If any of y'all watched the 40th anniversary Blu ray or just the Blu ray in general, did y'all ever notice when the mom comes into the house and she has a scarf on her head? And she's walking down the hallway and the lights bl are blinking. And as soon as she gets all the way up close to the camera and the lights go out for a second. And then they flicker back on. When they flicker back on, to the right of your screen, or at, to the right of your screen but the left side of her face, which is on the right side of the screen at this point. There is a... A awning? 
you will. They're like that the little type of thing you have above your stove that takes out the uh, smoke and stuff when you cook or something like that. It looks just like that. Anyway, when the lights flicker, I'll rewind this twice by the way, it looks like a head flashes on that silver thing. I'm not bullshitting. I rewind it twice. I'm like, wait a minute, did I just see what I think I saw? I seen it twice, like is that still is that in my head? Or was that fucking was that in the movie? I, I, it was weird, man. It was it was a head. It was right next to her head. It was What the fuck? <laughs> Let me know if y'all seen that. If y'all ever noticed something like that, or was that just my mind? Because this movie fucked with my mind so badly. I hope it's just my mind, but if that was an effect that one of us added for this movie or for this Blu-ray in general. That was well done because uh, that was kind of freaky. <laughs> that was freaky. But yeah, the Exorcist. Great film. Overall, I'm going to give The Exorcist my badass seal of approval. If you have not seen this movie, I'm talking about all my younger subscribers out there. You really, 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 really got to sneak this movie past your parents because <laughs> they won't let you watch it. Trust me, they will not let you watch this movie. Okay, all my older subscribers, all the the old school people knows what I'm talking about. But uh, yeah, y'all gonna find out when y'all get older. Y'all gonna fucking find out, boy. So let me know what y'all think about the Exorcist down below. Did you like it? Did you hate it? I'll see you guys in the sequels.